And so I kind of have a question for you that I think will lead me into your stance. Are the Eagles good or were the Falcons just really, really bad? I would love to know your take. I know it's your team and it's hard to separate the bias of head versus heart, but the Eagles did look good, but the Falcons also looked horrible. So how do you gauge the Falcons are terrible? How do you gauge the Eagles moving forward? I would love to hear your stance. Okay, so I know that we need to take off my Philadelphia Eagles fan hat at this moment. But last week I did make the case saying that in the NFC East, it's so unpredictable that you might as well go with the long shot, take the Eagles plus 480. I, w- I really was not saying that as an Eagles fan. I know it's hard to believe with the helmet behind me. But I understand it's one win. They beat the Falcons 32-6. I know people are going to say I'm reacting. But I think that the Eagles do indeed win the NFC East. Jalen Hurts, 27 for 35, 264 passing yards, three touchdowns, no turnovers, ran for 62 yards. His 77% completion rate is the highest ever on opening day for an Eagles quarterback. Now, Hurts also had three career starts with at least 250 passing yards, 60 rushing yards, one touchdown. So it's hard for me to not make the case that maybe the Eagles are going to be better than those expecting them to kind of have a down season, especially under Nick Sirianni, who I doubted. I also doubted the offense. I doubted the defense as well. And I'm a fan. I I get it. But holding Matt Ryan to 164 yards passing, they sacked him three times. The Falcons are nothing to rave about. They only won four games last season. So I understand having them week one is easy. But looking at this division, it's unfortunate for the Washington football team. They lost Ryan Fitzpatrick. He's going to be out at least eight weeks with that hip injury. Danny Dimes and the Giants, they look mediocre. Now the Cowboys... They did look good in their Thursday night football debut, but will Dak stay healthy? America's team always seems to disappoint America. So I do think that the Eagles, as my stance, will win the NFC East. 